Hey guys, I'm back. Um, today I am doing a leather punch. It is by a company called Brent. Um, the company was nice enough to give me one to review. So, um, probably is, I've already used it for my, um, my belt, so I don't really have anything else to punch at the moment. Um, but I will review it. Um, first thing you get is it's very heavy. Um, it's well built. I've had leather punches in the past. They weren't heavy. They were uh, light. They just they didn't feel well made. This one actually feels well made. Um, you have six different tip sizes here, and it rotates on a clockwise scale only. You cannot do counterclockwise. Um, it just does not turn. Um, you have a lock here, so you can lock it so it stays in place. It took me a few minutes to figure that one out because I was trying to stick it underneath the handle like this. It just was not working well. Um, so you do have a lock here. Um, now talking to the company, they do suggest putting a piece of leather, or uh, cardboard, underneath the leather or paper or whatever you're punching. Uh, because it will help the punch go through a lot better. Um, you're more likely to get caught or not get a perfect hole if you don't stick the cardboard under. So I did stick the cardboard under when I did it. Um, I'm actually going to, you know what, to test it, I'm actually going to use a piece of the cardboard that they gave me. How does that sound? Okay. Um, I don't have any cardboard though. So we're going to do it without cardboard just so I can show you what it's like. Oh, I don't want the plastic though. I don't know if it'll go through plastic very well. So we're going to do it without the plastic. Perfect. Okay. So we're going to do the smallest one. Well, well, the third smallest one, I guess. Alright, so you go ahead and you... Squeeze. See? And that's what I mean. If you don't stick the cardboard underneath, it doesn't seem to go through alright. You have to tear it off a little bit. Um, but, as you can tell, it does work. Um, I'll do another one with the big one so you can see a lot better. Uh, here's the biggest one. No hole. I'm going to sit here and I'm going to... See? It doesn't work. So what we do is I'm going to stick a piece of plastic underneath and then try it. And you have a hole. See, it didn't go through the first time, it did go through the second time. Um, so that's what I'm at. Um, it is actually a really good leather tool if you're going to punch leather, just use the cardboard. Um, it is recommended. The company actually has uh, sent me a few things and they've uh, both worked really well. So the last thing they sent me was oh, tire pressure gauges um, for my car. So I mean, my car has a, um, my car has the tire, tire, um, monitoring system, but it's, uh, nice, I can use it for bikes, you know, things like that, where normally you can't, um, but yeah, go ahead and, um, pick one of these up, I'm gonna put a link down below, so you can go ahead and, uh, um, grab one, again, this is Elvis, um, Batman's Reviews.tumblr.com, go ahead and go take a look, thank you.